Hey folks, this is Logan Wells with Dream Guitars. Uh, this, my friends, is a 2021 uh, number four model uh, from Dion Guitars. And whew, it is a delight. Uh, there's so much coolness going on with this guitar. It's gonna be, I'm gonna be hard pressed to kind of bang through it all in this here chit chat, but uh, I will do my best. Um, he's a, a younger maker, uh, Dion James, and doing excellent work. I really love his instruments. Um, fit and finish is flawless throughout modern aesthetics um, and some modern components as well, which we'll get into, um, makes for a really interesting build. Uh, his instruments, every single one of them, this one especially, are very quick. They just, the notes just, just fire right out of this here sound hole um, and sound port. Um, just very interesting stuff, man. Uh, so for this one, uh, we have Indian Rosewood for the back and sides, and we have Italian Spruce on top. Um, we also have a, a bunch of other really cool features happening here. We have a, a sound port, we have doubled sides, as well as a, a doubled back. So the body and the rim assembly are very stiff um, to allow that Italian Spruce top to vibrate as freely as possible. Um, we have a couple other cool features, including a carbon fiber bridge plate, um, which is a, a new thing that he's doing these days. Um, additionally, the neck has this like absolutely perfect uh, satin finish neck, um, satin finish, excuse me, on it, which uh, this neck is just perfect as far as I'm concerned. Um, slight elevated fingerboard as well. Um, really, it's just the works, so let's uh, hop on top. Um, uh, Italian Spruce, as I mentioned, Rosewood Bridge here. Um, I love his bridge, honestly. It's clean, understated, you know, it has sort of a traditional nod with the belly and the wings, but very much his own style. Nice little bevel on the top here. You will notice uh, we have gold Evo frets, which will last a lifetime. Uh, we also have a micro bevel here um, for your right arm, which, mm, excellent choice. Um, coming around to the side, here's that sound port I mentioned, and you can see the subtle uh, elevated fingerboard as well. Nice, good looking Indian rosewood for the back and for the sides. Very straight grained with a little bit of dramatic figuring, just a little bit um, for Indian rosewood, which is pretty cool. Most of it's just, Ladder straight, you know. We come down to a pretty low profile heel, um, so you can get your left hand up there pretty well. There's a little bit of flame in the neck, um, and that neck again feels perfect. Um, I forget the exact finish material that he uses for his necks. Um, it is different, I believe, from the body, um, but that satin feels so <laughs> nice in hand. Mm, really good looking stuff, and I love his headstocks. Um, the, yeah, this extra material kind of keeps going a little bit. Um, it just looks so good. And it's like, it, it's the little details, I tell you, man. Um, you have this nice bevel here for the edge. Um, and then he has this really cool thing with a nut where it's actually integrated down into the fingerboard itself. Um, I really love that. And again, Evo frets. Yeah. So, if you want to get into a uh, number four Dion that you know, you can do pretty much whatever you want. Um, you know, if you're looking for a guitar that's quick and lively, um, super exciting, you know, <laughs> to play, uh, this is an excellent uh, instrument. So if you want to learn more, give us a shout. Cheers. Mm -hmm.